Another Seattle neighborhood dealing with a tire slasher, this time in South Seattle's Dunlap neighborhood. Thank you for joining us for the news at 10. I'm Frankie Thompson. Once again, the suspected tire slasher was caught on camera, tool in hand, even leaving one family stranded on their way to the hospital. Fox 13's Dave Detling joining us in the newsroom. Dave, you spoke with some of the victims. How many vehicles were disabled because of this tire slasher? On 42nd Street, I counted at least four vehicles still with flat tires. Others had donuts on them. Neighbors say the guy caught on camera hit at least a dozen vehicles that they know of, and they worry there may be more people impacted. The guy just kind of using a knife and slicing through, and it's an easy, like, fast thing to do and cause a lot of, a lot of troubles. So. Video shared with Fox 13 shows the man neighbors say is responsible for their current headache and costly tire repair bills. You could tell it's a lot of... SUV cars, so that's the kind of cars that we're, we're kind of focused on, so we were pretty mad about that. This victim, who asked not to be identified for safety reasons, had to fork over $600 after the man in the video took a tool to his vehicle's tires. It happened late Thursday night into early Friday morning. It's not cheap. Damage from the man's actions still apparent in the 7,000 block of 42nd Avenue South near Myrtle on Saturday. Multiple cars parked on the curb are still deflated, including John's Kia SUV. It was a little bit terrifying. Uh, it was very painful. Not only was it an inconvenience, he says the man created a dangerous driving hazard. John and his wife got in their car, not realizing the tires were out of air. I was just... Uh going to a hospital, taking my wife to a nearby hospital. Just we realized the uh, tires were flat. It was a little bit stressful, you know, just to come back again and we went back. Now, neighbors are busy making police reports and repairs, all while reviewing home surveillance footage. They're hoping someone recognizes the tire slasher so cops can get him off the street. I'm feeling a little bit unsafe moving out at night, like just if he snatched the tires, he can smash that on me too. And if you recognize that individual, you're asked to call Seattle Police. If you're a victim and haven't already done so, you're encouraged to fill out an online police report. In the newsroom, Dave Detling, Fox 13 News.